OK, so on this last example, um, basically what we're going to do is, again, we're going to solve and graph the absolute value inequalities. Now, there's a couple things I noticed. Do not worry about what the inequality is until you've isolated your absolute value. So you guys can see my absolute value here is being multiplied by 3, and it's being subtracted by 3. So we're always going to want to undo addition and subtraction first. So I add a 3 to both sides. So I have 3 times the absolute value of x minus 2 over 5 is less than 9. Is everybody following me so far? Then we've got to undo multiplying by 3. So I divide by 3. So I have x minus 2 is greater than 5. Absolute value is less than 3. Now my absolute value is isolated. So now I can separate using my two cases. It's a less than, so that's going to make it a and inequality. So I'd have x minus 2 over 5 is less than 3. And x minus 2 is greater than negative 3. Right? I negated and I had to flip the sign. Follow? OK. So ladies and gentlemen, there's a couple different ways um, we can do this. The best thing I like to do is get rid of my fraction. So to get rid of my fraction in this case, I'm going to multiply by a 5. Let's do that on both sides. Well, since I'm multiplying this whole expression and dividing this whole expression by 5s, the 5s will divide out. So therefore, I'll be left with an x minus 2 is less than 15. And uh, x minus 2 is greater than negative 15. Add 2, add 2. x is less than 17. And add 2, add 2. x is greater than negative 13. So I kind of ran out of space. So let's go back up here. I'm going to go by fives on this one. 0, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, negative 5, negative 10, negative 15, negative 20. So x has to be less than 17. So I'm going to go over to 17, make a nice big circle. That's less than. So I'm just going to go off my graph and just go to the left. x has to be greater than negative 13. So I'm going to go over here, go off my graph, and then go between. And then the only area that makes both of my inequalities true, right? because remember, and is an intersection, is going to be between my two values. Everybody follow me with that? Yes, no, maybe so. That's it. All right, I'm done. No more talking. I'm tired.